again, just in a That's little bit bad. here. I'm not bad now. And then, uh, so once again, my name was Sean O'Brien for the camera. Say your first and last name. Miles Plumley. And we're gonna be doing six laps in a beautiful Ferrari 488 GTV. Sound good? Sounds great. Right on. As you can see, mirrors set up for me. I'll watch for any cars coming up behind you on the right of the left. I'll let you know when to pass any other cars on the right of the left. Basically, just wait for my call outs, wait for my instructions, and you'll be good to go out there, okay? Cool. Keeping your eyes up is what's gonna be key that you're staying in front of the car with your vision, looking through your corners, looking where you wanna go. And then just an overall smoothness, smooth with the brakes, but firm. Smooth with the steering and balance, smooth with that throttle as you come off those corners. Like I said, I'll give you tips, pointers, help you improve. I'll let you go as fast as you want, man, as long as you're doing things right. Deal? Cool. Sounds good. Right on. All right. Um, paddle shifts, upshift on right, downshift on left. I'm sure you're familiar with those. I'll tell you when to upshift. I'll tell you when to downshift. It's mostly a fourth, mostly fifth gear track, and a little bit of sixth needed on that long straightaway out there. So mm -hmm. I'll call you out the gear changes for you. It's not an overwhelming amount of gear changes, but there'll be a couple. You said you're gonna be a fifth, mostly. You're not gonna drop down to like below that much. No, you're going to fourth into the hairpin, but mm -hmm. that's it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, that road I took up to the mountains was like literally second and third the whole way. Oh yeah. It was like vroom, vroom, vroom. It was really. Yeah, trying to make it smoother and have you know yeah. cause left shifting to do. I mean, this thing this thing climbs up uh, climbs up that RPM RPM gauge pretty quick. So. Yeah. Cool. Uh, it's got a lot of torque too. Uh, questions? I don't think so. Foot on the brake, upshift once to put it into gear. Yep. You're clear, pull forward, and make a U turn to the left. Alright, hang out for this uh, silver AMG Merc, and then we'll be good after they go by. Go ahead, over to your right, and upshift. to come out wide to the there we go turn in now towards your apex squeeze back into the throttle start to unwind to the left straighten out that wheel all the way down shift brake downshift now start to trail off the brakes and then turn it down towards your apex that's the trick is getting your heavy braking done at the beginning of the corner or at the beginning of the braking zone that way you can start to trail off the brakes at the end brake good start turning in trail off the brakes squeeze back into the throttle come out about half track no more then right back over to your right side to your right side and then back over quickly to your left side up and over the crest now throttle down the hill come out wide and then back over left, so we'll use more space next time. Break, downshift, and then turn in towards your apex, good. Start to squeeze back into the throttle, unwind the wheel just a little bit, and then make your way back over to the right. All the way to the right, now break, back over to left and throttle. Break straight, but not very heavy, and then turn in towards your apex. Turn in more, now start to throttle and unwind to the left. Good, make sure you unwind that wheel all the way out to the left. Apex, turn more. Now start to unwind to the left, straighten it out. Brake, good. Start turning while braking and then release the brakes. Squeeze the throttle back over to the right. Good, brake light, then left. There you go. A little bit of throttle, come out wide right, then over to the left. Brake, downshift, and turn in. Try to get all the way over to the left hand side before you turn in. Got it. Throttle, unwind the wheel a little bit. More throttle. To the right, to the right. Brake. Now left and throttle. Good. Touch your brake. Turn it in quickly towards your apex. Start to unwind the wheel. Straighten it out. Straighten it out.
slides down and then throttle as you come off of the corner. So later on the corner? Brake. Eyes right. Turn in. The vision is key. Look where you want to go. Throttle to the right. All the way right. Now left. All the way left. All the way left. Good. Start to throttle more. Unwind the wheel a little. Unwind the wheel a little. Don't hug it so tight to the left. Let it come out wide then back over to the left. Downshift. Turn it in quickly. Now throttle, unwind the wheel a little bit. To the right. There you go. Brake, turn, throttle. Turn first. Throttle, throttle, throttle. Good brake. Turn. Turn more. Now throttle, throttle, throttle. Good. Unwind the wheel all the way to the edge. I want you to end up right on that line. Good. Shift up. Kind of start to make sense to yeah, the end yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's hard to get all of that explained um, mm -hmm. while it's happening. Mm -hmm. I can only kind of give you the tips on the fly, yeah, but I don't yeah. want to cut your session and just be like, hey, all right, let's stop, let's talk about this. You yeah. know, let's enjoy it because it's like any other thing else, like any other sport, right? You practice at yeah, it, you yeah, get yeah. better at it. The better you get, the more you want to do it, right? So I got a plan, like, yeah, the. Yeah, got so, like, learning the car is so part of it. Where we picked it up? Pit stall number one, all the way down at the end. Learning the car is part of it. Figure out what it can do, what it can do, what it's going to feel like, you know, mm -hmm. the suspension setup, the steering wheel, the ratio, things like that make a big difference. Especially when you go from Italian cars to German cars, they have very different characteristics. Yeah, I can't wait to see the difference. Go ahead and pull back on both paddles at the same time. Cool. And then take your foot off the brake and crank that wheel all the way to the right. One full rotation, let it sit right here. Um, and then learning the track too, seeing how much space you can use, where you want to be, positioning yourself on track, things like that. Is it a late apex? Is it an early apex? Some of the configurations of it, right? Mm -hmm. Some of the technical stuff. But it's the eyes, it's the vision, that's what ties it all together. Yeah. Your vision is what's you, what your eyes see is what's going to tell your brain what it needs to do to process, to tell your hands and your feet what they need to be doing, mm -hmm. and then those two things to work together as well. So 
Um, you said you're driving another car after this? Yeah. Which one? The GT3? Yeah, are you doing with oh, me? Okay, cool. Um, I tr typically, I'm not sure how they're doing instructors. I'm in the Ferrari today. Okay. Let it actually run. I have to take care of the car. Got it. And I do a little cool down procedure. Let me get